Hey there, and welcome back to my channel. In this video, we're going to talk about some of the animation mistakes in Miraculous Ladybug. But before we start, I want to clarify that we love Miraculous, and this video is just for fun. Now that we've made that clear, let's start with the third episode of Season 5, Destruction. This episode has tons of errors. You may not have seen them on a first watch, but I think we've captured them all here. Let's start at the beginning of the episode. When Gabriel asks the Kwamis for Ladybug's real name, the spell that prevents the Kwamis from revealing their holder's name or their guardians is activated. However, Nuro is also affected by the spell. Despite the fact that he's the only Kwami in Gabriel's possession that doesn't even know who Ladybug is. In the very same scene, when the camera angle records from the back, we can see Noro's wings are flapping. However, in the next scene, they seem motionless. If you ask me, this is a pretty interesting way to see Noro fly. Also in this scene, we see Gabriel try to put some pressure on Ariko, and Sass suddenly interrupts their conversation. If you take a closer look, you're going to realize that something is a bit off. Yeah, that's right. Sass's eye color is white instead of being green-yellowish. After managing to get clues from the Kwamis about the guardian of all the miraculous, Monarch appears in Marinette's room. Shocked by the light, Marinette gets up from her bed. In that time, you might notice that Marinette is missing some hair on her right side. In the episode Multiplication, knowing that the Kwamis are not with her anymore, Marinette lays the Miraculous box to the side before calling Alia. However, Marinette's sewing box is shown to be in a different place when Marinette encounters Monarch in her room. In order to get rid of the heroes, Monarch pulls Cat Noir's hands to get cataclysmed. When Monarch teleports after being cataclysmed, the Ox, Dragon, Mouse, and Fox Miraculouses are shown in their charged mode instead of their activated mode. Before that scene, when Marinette greets the Kwamis and the Kwamis hug Marinette, Bark changes his body color. Normally, it should be orange. However, when we look at this scene up close to Marinette's face, we actually see that the Kwami has a pink color instead. In the flashback of Ladybug and Veronique setting up a trap, the statue of a knight can be seen in Cat Noir's photo, even though all the statues were covered at the time. Towards the end of the episode, Marinette is talking to Alia about their plan. When Marinette picks up the little red yo-yo, Kalki is seen without her mane. At the end of the episode, to avoid losing any more Miraculouses, Gabriel destroys all of them, turning them into dust. This dust-like material that is made is the exact same size, even though each of the Miraculouses are different sizes. How is that possible? When Marinette is trying to teach the Kwamis how to trick Shadow Moth to prevent him from finding out Marinette's identity as Ladybug and the Guardian, Fluff is not shown with the Kwamis. We know this is weird because he was seen in the Miraculous box before. And in the next scene, Fluff is shown with the Kwamis. But again, in a later scene, Fluff is not shown again. They just keep forgetting about him. We also see Gabriel transform into Monarch in his lair, and all of his weapons are pictured around him. But in some scenes, we can see some of those weapons are missing. Before Alia walks into Marinette's bedroom, when Marinette is handing the keychain to Monarch, her left eye is squinted shut, and her right eye is closed normally. Uh, Marinette? Are you feeling okay? Oh yeah, you see that keychain, right? Monarch is shown breaking the yo-yo apart to see the number 42. However, when he transports to the next place, ta-da, the keychain looks as if it's brand new, completely repaired. In the same scene, when Alia opens her phone to go live, she first focuses the phone on Marinette. If you take a look at the Marinette on the screen, you're going to realize that her hair is kind of going through her head. Again, in the same scene, when Alia walks into Marinette's bedroom, she's holding a tray. After she sees Monarch, she drops the tray in shock. However, in the next scenes, the tray can't be found anywhere. 
Maybe it was a magic trick that made it disappear. Finally, we see the perspective of Marinette looking at Alia while she's recording her live to expose Monarch. When the scene turns to Monarch, Marinette's angle is the same, even though the angle of the room changes. Okay guys, that's the end of this video. I hope you enjoyed all the animation mistakes we found. Were there any that you think we missed? Let us know in the comments. For more videos, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel, like the video, and comment your ideas down below. I hope to see you all soon. Bye!